Good morning, guys. I am at uh, the Harrogate Show, the Warner's Harrogate Show in Harrogate. <laughs> been a good show so far. I've been doing lots of talks. We've just finished one talk, which we filled in for uh, Peter Vaughan. He's off on the Morocco trip, which Tash is going to be on. I'm taking her down to the airport um, in uh, next week, so that's going to be great. Um, but yeah, so we've done. We just filled in for him. We just done his talk, uh, which which turned out brilliant but to be honest John carried that John was an absolute legend he knows so much about motorhomes camper vans the vehicles the models the specs he knows them inside out I'm good at you know standing up talking stupid stuff about myself how I do stuff how I find park ups and how I live but he knows the facts and the figures and the real deal so top marks to John yeah legend um, but yeah gonna have a little walk around I've got a few little bits uh, I want to I want to buy I need a washing up bowl, um, but yeah, it's the first real outing with the new motorhome. Um, parked up uh, with the traders um, because we're obviously speaking here, so I'm parked up with the traders. Um, got the got all the guys here. So there's uh, John and Tash. There's Mevy, John and Mandy are here. We've uh, they've all piled in the van the last couple of nights, um, all around the big table, which is brilliant. It's exactly what I want. Um, being able to you know, um, all sit around the, the table, have dinner. To be fair, I haven't got any footage of it. Um, we were just all just chilling out because after a long uh, long day of talking to people and doing talks and this, that and the other and walking around, it, it, it gets to you a bit. And in the evening, you just like, start, you're like, I want to chill out now. And we, we want to eat. So um, we're going to have a little wander around the show. I've got a few more talks to do later today. Um, me and Tasha are doing one about living full-time in a motorhome and then me and John have got one straight after that about the essential tech gadgets. It's going really well. I'm really liking the Warner shows at the moment. They're really well set up, really well laid out. You've got a lot of traders here. You've got a lot of vans here for people to look around, get stuck into, loads of traders, good stuff going on. So let's have a little walk around, grab a, grab a few little bits and bobs. I need a kettle as well. I need a kettle. <laughs> so. I've got carpets for the motorhome, um, which obviously come with it. Um, but I've just been and seen Gerald at the uh, at this stand, and he's at all the shows this year. I've just ordered rubber mats, heavy duty rubber mat, and that'll be perfect for the front. It's going to be the right shape and size because um, I've given him the spec, uh, the year, the model, um, and yeah, he'll have that ready for me at Peterborough, which is. Uh, Brilliant. Cheers, Gerald. Couldn't find a bowl that's big enough for my sink because my sink's quite large. But I got a small bowl, goes with the uh, the red upholstery. Oh, wow. <laughs> bully, bully. And I got a non slip mat for the big executive table to uh, stop things moving and uh, protect the table a little bit. Because uh, I am clumsy, I will drop stuff. But yeah, cut a little bit. Off the stalls. I found my way to the, the food stall and uh, yeah, <laughs> sausage and bacon sandwich with cheese and fried onions and some chips. And we're right close to the van, so make my way back to the van. Things are going great at this show. Um, our talks are actually going down an absolute storm, and I can't thank everyone enough that's coming to watch us talk and waffle on about you know about traveling about me and Tasha doing the full time full time in a motorhome talk and me and John have been doing the um, essentials tech gadgets and gizmos um, one thing that has been cropping up a lot though in in these talks is people are very interested in the power banks because the power banks are so useful they can be so versatile they can be if you can't get the van that you want right now you can go buy a power bank because you don't want to put a full system in because you might not be keeping that van. Um, if you're just a weekend warrior, you're only going away for a couple of times a year or you know a month at max, and you don't want to commit to a full system, then power banks are a great option. Now, obviously, I've got a full system. John's got a full system. Most full timers have, and I, I can't. If you are going to get a full system, I can't recommend EcoTree enough. They are. Their batteries are amazing. Um, details for them will be in the description below. But as I've just been sent the EcoFlow River 2 Pro, I thought I'd compare that with a Jackery and a Bluetti. 
don't worry it's not the whole thing if you want to watch the full thing there'll be uh, links in the description below and there'll be a card up top and you can watch the full comparison video of all three of these power banks and which one's the best and which one most importantly can cook me bacon lunch break over scoffed our faces now heading back down to the uh the conference room um ready to do two talk back to back one with tash one with john and uh, yeah be good right now he's got a suitcase here which was your grandmum's yeah grandmum's <laughs> yeah yeah but he does look you know all jokes you know that's nice and sentimental but he does look like Del Boy running around with it. He really does. So I've got him another bag. Here we go. Has he got Russian dolls in it? See, I'm actually in an episode of this. Are you? Yeah, the one with the Russian video cameras. Filmed in, it was all filmed in Bristol down the road. You weren't making up. that blue movie, were No, you? I was in the crowd watching <laughs> And that is a wrap. That is seven talks done over the weekend from Friday to Sunday. I had loads of people turn out, come and listen to the talks. I really appreciate you coming along. I just had two hours solid of talking, so I'm a bit, I'm a bit cream crackered. I mean, I know I can waffle on quite for the best with the best of people, but yeah, a little bit cream crackered now. The boys are coming home from a hard day's work. <laughs> They've been down to pit. Yeah. <laughs> Get <in> the call. <laughs> oh. Back in the my home. What a brilliant weekend. Um, first Warner show of the year to kick it off, and it's actually been it's been an absolute banger. Um, talks have gone down really well, which I'm really pleased about. Um, we've done six talks. And then we filled in for uh, Peter Vaughan um, because he's flying out with um, to the Morocco trip, uh, which is which Tash is following. It, like I said earlier, um, so yeah, we've done that this morning. Went down a treat. Um, yeah, had a little walk around the show. I've got a few little bits and bobs. I've ordered a mat, like I said, a rubber mat for the front. Um, got my sink and um, some non-slip uh, things to the table. But yeah, apart from that. Talking to loads of people, helping them out. You know, we've got a lot of people that are trying to do some extended trips, go full time, looking for looking for vans, looking for you know camper vans, and looking for uh, motorhomes. Uh, wanting a bit of advice, which is great to help them out. Yeah, it's definitely worth coming to these shows and going to motorhome forecourts um, if you are looking for a, for a, a motorhome or a camper van. Um, you need to get in them and get get stuck in. You know, get out there, have a little look around and uh get in them and see see what the layouts work for you what what does what doesn't um so yeah come to these kind of shows or you know head on over to to uh some at home forecourts whatever's local to you or definitely you know i could definitely recommend uh visiting oak tree they've got loads of uh, uh options on their forecourt and they're they're more than happy to show you around their motorhomes. homes so definitely do that but yeah brilliant one to start the year next one will be peterborough so I'll be at that. So if you've not got your tickets to that, then make sure you, uh, well, the link will be in the description below. Get Head on down there. It is the last Peterborough show because they have sold the showground. Not Warners. Warners are just going there to the showground to do their event. But the Peterborough showground has been sold. Um, so, yeah, this is the last one. So I think they're going to go out of a bang. Um I am talking at that. I know Tash is talking at that as well, and so is John. So, yeah, you need to head on and definitely come to that show. Uh, it's going to be a banger. And now I've got someone here trying to distract me. There you go. Look at that. If you like this video, make sure you check out this one and this one, and I'll catch you guys in the next. Take it easy. Bye.